Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. We're doing another makeup look in my seven days uh, to Diwali makeup series and I'm starting out with primed eyelids, brows in place and I'm just putting tapes on the sides of my eyes to get that precision cat eye effect. Um, for my primer, I have used soft ochre paint pot as usual and for my brows, it's my L'Oreal Palmet Ecstatic in the shade Brunette. I'm just going to use baby lips on my lips to prime them and get them ready for the lipstick later on. And then we're gonna jump straight in with the eyeshadows. I'm using tempera to set my primer in place with a big fluffy brush, placing that all over my eyelids and taking it all the way up to my brow bone. And then I'm going in with the shade Dusty Rose with the same brush and I'm just concentrating that in my crease a little bit towards my brow bone as well and just building that color intensity using windshield wiper motions and circular motions where needed um, just getting that transition shade in place next up i'm taking the shade um, cypress umber and i'm using a denser brush for this one it's a little bit more concentrated to get that perfect um, transition and you know so that the color fades into dusty rose. I'm going to take my time building the intensity and dragging the shade inwards as well. I think I'm using this brush from the palette itself. I'm using the fluffier side to sort of blend out this shadow and using windshield wiper motions and circular motions in the outer corner. And really you wanna make sure that you take your time blending because that is the key for this look. Then I'm going in with Dusty Rose again with that first brush we used and just um, blending it all out, making sure that there are no harsh edges and also making sure that that color is staying like it shows through. Then I'm taking Sultry in the middle of my eyelids. I haven't, um, obviously as you can see, haven't carved off my eyelids or anything, neither have I wet the brush. I am using it as is just to, um, I'm really packing on the color, I'm not dragging or anything like that, I'm just going in the pan, dipping my brush, packing it onto my um, eyelids and then just um, kind of diffusing the color into the uh, cypress umber shade. And then um, for my inner corner, I'm taking the shade bronze and placing that just um, very like in the in the corner for well, not in my tear duct though just in my inner third of the eye and also overlapping that with um sultry and bronze so you want to make sure that they kind of diffuse into each other and not just stay you know like there's no harsh line like it's looking right now you have to make sure that you go in and blend and then I'm just deepening the outer corner um, with Cypress Umber once again. And this time I'm just concentrating that in the outer corner just to intensify that shade. And then I'm taking like a really tiny um, precision brush, precision blending brush, and just diffusing out all the edges that, you know, from the shadows that we've just put down. Then I'm going in with Tempera again, and I'm going to um, highlight my brow bone with this one and also blend out the blend out the dusty rose shadow um, making sure that there are no harsh edges or harsh lines anywhere and then i'm just going to do my foundation and concealer and powder off camera and then i'll come back in with my bronzer i'm using the rimmel good to glow bronzer i think it's in the shade amber all the shades and everything will be listed down below and the links to the products if I can find them I will post them down below so be sure to check that out I'm using a big fluffy brush to bronze up my face give me that nice glow sun-kissed look since you know we're in Australia and we're in summer now I think it's officially summer because it is really really hot outside today <laughs> so yeah making sure that I hide my double chin and then for my blush today I'm using uh, this Sephora blush I haven't used in ages but it's beautiful and goes really perfectly with the eye this is I believe in the shade from Bois Attraction number no. three and really packing on this blush making sure that it kind it's cohesive with the eyeshadow For my highlighter today, I am using 
the L'Oreal La Vienne Glow and I'm using the pink shade from that palette and I'm using this tapered br brush from BH Cosmetics. Wow! I honestly cannot get enough of these highlighters. They are so beautiful. Just highlighting the usual places, you know, all the high points of your face, making sure that tip of my nose is covered, um, bridge of my nose, as well as Cupid's bow and chin. And I always like to do it a little bit on my forehead, just on the temples of my forehead. I feel like it looks beautiful. Then I'm gonna go in and complete my under eye. I'm using Cypress, Cypress Umber. Um, for my lower lash line and then I'm actually going to top it up with the shade Dusty Rose with a precision brush Just blending it all out and making sure that everything is connected to the upper eye area as well And then just dusting off any fallout that I might have had um, There's nothing on the brush. It's just a clean uh, tapered brush and then I'm going to uh, line and tight line the inner rims of my eyes with the Maybelline Colossal Kajal in black. I feel like this eye look definitely called for that intensity. And then for my inner corner highlight, I'm going to use that same um, highlight that we used for our face. And then I'm also going to use this on, on the um, arch of my brows. And then I'll do my um, liner, mascara, and lashes off camera, and then I'll come back with my lip liner. This is, I believe, Petal from Jordana. And I'm just gonna quickly line my eyes with this one and for my lipstick today, I'm using ColourPop, and I believe it's in the shade solar but yeah that marks the end of this video you guys thank you so much for tuning in i hope you found this video helpful and i hope you do recreate it please do not forget to like this video share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already until next time take care bye